Hello Capricorn and Cross Watchers. Thank you so much for tuning in. This is going to be your weekend read for September 13th, 14th, and 15th. Um, you versus them. So guys, if you're currently a subscriber, I would just like to thank you so much for all the love and support you have shown my channel. Um, if you have not yet subscribed, please be sure to do so. I do uh, give away free readings every single month, okay? And I give away tarot cards and oracle cards, okay? So the little bell next to that subscribe button, please be sure to click that also because the winners are announced every month on your monthly love reading. Um, so this way you'll get the notification for when those readings come out to see if you have won anything, all right? Um, I have premeditated on the I meditated on the decks before um, I, I got on camera. I did a couple of shuffles, uh, I think on camera. I'm not sure if I did or if I didn't, but they've been meditated over. Okay, um, I am taking personal readings, guys. Ten dollars off your first reading with me. Information is in the description box below. Okay, um, the deck that we're using today is the Radiant Wise deck, one of my top three favorite decks. I love this deck. It is number 20 in the description box below. There is an Amazon link in case you guys are interested in purchasing. Um, and guys, if this resonates, great. If it doesn't resonate, it's just simply not your message. So Capricorn, I'm gonna read you on this side and your person on this side. Um, if it resonates the other way around, feel free to switch it. That's not a problem, it's a general reading, so you can you know, place this however way it resonates in your life, okay? Now, um, starting with you, Capricorn, we have chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here, all right? We have let go of control issues, allow the situation to unfold naturally, okay? So you may be really attracted to somebody, Capricorn, and you're getting impatient because you really want to uh, be with this person. Um, we could be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, okay? Um, this could be you who's independent, single, financially stable, or it could be your person. Um, this could be a third party situation. It could be someone that you're crushing on outside of your relationship because we have here the two of pentacles, which means that you would be juggling two people. And we have the moon, which is telling me that this is something that you're keeping as a secret, something that nobody knows about. Um, this is something that you're keeping to yourself. So we could be dealing with a Pisces, a Virgo. We could be dealing with a Libra. So we've got the justice card here. So I feel like, you know, you're trying to do the right thing. You're trying to do the right thing, but I feel like the passion here and the chemistry is just uncontrollable, okay? It's just like you're trying to control it, but you just can't, okay? Now, on your person side, we have free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life, okay? And we have true love. This is the romance of a lifetime. Interesting. Two totally different sides of the spectrum there. Um, so I'm seeing here that someone here is taking action. They're taking action in judging who they want to be with, with the, the judgment card and the lover's card. So the lover's card, we could be dealing with a Gemini, okay? And, um, no, I'm sorry. With the lover's card, we could be dealing with a Gemini. With the judgment card, we could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Um, so I feel here that your person is taking action and deciding on who they want to choose to be with, okay? Um, I feel here that someone may be withdrawing. They may be withdrawing from this connection, okay? They may feel like you are their true love, but they may be withdrawing. Or they may see that you're taking action and making a decision that you're that you're cheating. You know what I'm saying? They may say, I, I got to, you know, I, I'm freeing myself from the situation because... I'm freeing myself from the situation because they're starting to see that you're an undecided between lovers. But this person really loves you, though, Capricorn. This person, they feel like you're their true love. They feel like they're your soulmate, but they're going to withdraw with this Virgo energy here. Um, we could be dealing with the Virgo because they feel like you're interested in someone else. Um, the energy for you guys this weekend is going to be a little cold. It's going to be not emotional. It's going to be, um, you know... 
you guys are going to be withdrawing from each other. The, the, you know, what's crossing the situation, the challenge here is that you guys are withdrawing and staying in your heads. You're just doing nothing but thinking. You're keeping your emotions to yourself and guarding your hearts. You see that, how they're holding their hearts there? And, um, yeah, I feel like there may be some arguments over someone new in the picture. There, there may be arguments because we've got the page of, of wands here. We've got the ace of wands and we have the eight of wands. And we have someone who's being very defensive, okay? Very defensive about a distraction. So I feel that your person, Capricorn, sees that, you know, maybe it's a friend or somebody that both of you know. Um, Capricorn, I feel that your person sees that there's some type of chemistry between you and someone else. And there's going to be a lot of arguing about this. There's going to be a lot of arguing about this. They're going to feel, you know, I can hear it in my head. Oh, do you want to sleep with her? Oh, do you want to sleep with him? Or, you know, there's going to be a lot of arguments here. Um, and I'm showing here that we could be dealing with a cancer. Someone here is quickly, you know, taking action towards being stubborn. Okay. <laughs> you know, they're, they're making a decision to move forward. And no matter what you offer this person, um, you know, they're just unhappy. They're being, they're being, you know, stubborn and they just don't want to listen to anything that you have to say. They're just not buying anything that you're, that you're trying to say. Okay. All right, Capricorn, so if this resonated, please be sure to like and uh, don't forget to subscribe to enter a chance to win. And um, if you would like to book me for a personal reading, uh, my information is in the description box below. Take care, guys.